Good morning guys, so this was technically my first day of uni, as you can tell, Sharifa, my older sister, left me a little note and I got myself some hot water and breakfast and I started planning out my day. So I'm using the Mossary planner here to plan out my day. Um, I already had everything I had to do today scheduled and I'm just adding a few extra tasks in. So I still had some time before my first session, which was at 10 in the morning. So I decided to have my breakfast and read for a little bit. So I'm currently reading How to Win Friends and Influence People by Dale Carnegie. Um, it's been a great nonfiction read. And I love reading nonfiction in the morning because it just goes right to my head um, with a fresh mind. So five minutes before my session started, I came back to my study space and I started setting it up. Um, so I have my little rough book here for some notes. Since this wasn't really a formal lecture, it was more of like a session to kind of introduce us to the faculty and some of the facilities in terms of doing it online and stuff. So here I am joining the lecture, of course, with my video and mic on mute. <laughs> and I'm setting up some of my stationery just in case I need it. And then we had the awareness session for about one hour. Of course, I didn't film the entire thing. So then after that, um, I came back in the afternoon after taking a wash and changing to do some filing before I had my afternoon lecture. So I don't really keep a notebook or anything like that. I um, basically just use files and portfolios. Um, I prefer having the flexibility of putting in papers wherever, wherever I want to put them in. So I'll just divide the file based on the modules I'm doing and then I'll just insert any worksheets or basically like any other resources that the teachers provide to us or I'm able to find on my own. So they did send us the timetable prior to the lecture starting so I decided to print um, the timetable out and cut it up and basically stick all of the pages into like this giant scroll <laughs> um, so you can see that's what I'm doing here. This was actually kind of therapeutic and uh, yeah this is I felt like it would be very convenient to have the timetable right in front of me so I wouldn't have to worry about forgetting or missing lectures and it's put up right in front of me. <laughs> I still had some time on my hands before my next lecture, so I decided to pick up the book I've been reading recently. So I've been reading The Way of Kings Part 1 by Brandon Sanderson. It's an epic fantasy and it's been so much fun reading it. It's so comforting and I constantly feel like I'm at a bonfire and it's raining and we're on a battlefield and I just, I love it. So it's finally time for my 1 p.m. lecture. Um, I did know this was also more of an introduction session. So um, I decided to prepare just a blank sheet where I could mind map any information I needed, to, I needed to know about this particular module, which ended up working in my favor actually.
I tried to dress up for the session because this was my first lecture, my first official lecture as an undergraduate, so I thought I should put in at least a little bit of effort. I ended up switching on my camera for approximately one minute um, throughout this two hour session. <laughs> As you can tell, I'm doing the mind mapping here and I've always preferred a mind maps over any other sort of notes because they're just so flexible and they're a lot more visual and I am definitely a visual learner, so they really do help for me. So I finally finished that lecture and it's time to go downstairs and have lunch at 3 p.m. <laughs> So I'm just putting everything away and ta-ta, finally! After that, I decided to go out onto the balcony for some fresh air and here I have with me some aloe vera juice and my trusted bottle of water. This time I'm going to be reading something on the iPad instead of a physical copy. So I've recently been turning to more comfort reads and one of my favorite comfort reads recently has been Nevermore The Trials of Morgan Crow by Jessica Townsend which is such a great middle grade fantasy. I know this is targeted towards a younger audience, but I genuinely love this series. It's just so magical. Let's see the first time. Yeah. Why do you have two names for one plant? It's not one plant, you it's two. I think it's two. I'll bring yours. Rafa isn't drinking tea. Oh, So after tea time with the family and getting some reading done, once the sun set, I usually try not to schedule too much work and obviously since I didn't have much work this day, I just went straight to my planner and started ticking off any tasks that I completed and migrating tasks that I didn't complete. Usually I don't plan for the next day, the day before, I try to wake up in the morning and write everything down. But I was so afraid that I'd forget <laughs> to do these things. I decided to just plan them the night before just, just to make myself feel a little bit more comforted knowing that it's written down and I don't have to constantly think about it. <laughs> One of my favorite parts of my planner layout is my gratitude log and I usually try not to think too much about this either. Whatever at the top of my head in the moment, I just put it down. And of course, I need to end it with Alhamdulillah, thank you Allah, or God. And that's pretty much um, my day, my first day of uni. Um, of course, it wasn't very study heavy, but I hope you guys enjoyed.